West Wind was an interesting site. Good wind, good average speed. And so the idea of West Wind has been around maybe 15, 20 years. Now it wasn't until recently that the technology made it worthwhile to explore West Wind. We actually got the whole Meridian team pretty excited about the project as well, about how cool this was going to be for New Zealand, for Wellington, for Meridian. And uh, we then took that overseas to the turbine suppliers. We spent a lot of time measuring at, at different locations. Some of the turbine manufacturers got pretty nervous with some of the, some of the locations. We had had some dealings with Siemens here and the local people got quite excited. They went back to Denmark and they sort of said, look, you've got to talk to these guys, these guys are serious. And so we went over to Denmark and it was, it was quite a make or break um, meeting. We were having the CFO, the, the CEO, the, the head of sales, the, the chief technical officer were, were coming in. And there was also a row of photos um, along the wall and we sort of said, well, there's, there's a slot there for West Wind and that's, that's your next iconic project that you guys are going to have on your wall. There were a number of challenging parts of the project. I guess the, the consenting part of it, I mean, just the whole development phase of the project was very difficult. Um, you know, building the, the, the sea access option. Where it is, it's landlocked. It's, a, it's an island in the middle of a, of a city. Uh, roads are very, very tight, a lot of activity around here, a lot of people. So the only way you could build West Wind was to bring everything in by sea. We had some meetings in Denmark and um, Seaman said it's, it's too risky, we can't do this. Um, it's, it's not actually something that we can control. Um, it's, it's, it's outside our realms of, of risk analysis. And so we said, well, we'll do it. So the project constructed a, a, a wharf. Uh, they shipped all the, all the components from Denmark to Picton and then moved them across the Cook Strait on a, on a barge and then trucked them up on site. From our perspective, having known the history, known the choices that we made in terms of the turbine supplies we could have gone with and the outcome, we're immensely proud of, of how West Wind is actually operating and performing on that site. Having been involved with that project uh, probably over a period of 14 years, and then to finally see it you know, get constructed and then the turbines actually operating, it's uh, fantastic. Mm -hmm.